Hi everyone, it's Said here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make an open door like this in Dialux Evo because we actually don't have um, a standard open door here in Apertures. We only have um, like a standard door like this one, which is closed. And we want to make our designs like a little bit fancy. So I'm gonna do like what I did for this shower here like an open door like this one we're, we're gonna do exactly the same thing for this little kitchen so we can have like a nice views from here to get started let's go to the floor plan view here and then this is actually the door that we want to make like this one we want it to be open so let's click on it and here are its dimensions the height the width and the depth the way we're gonna proceed is actually by deleting this one or I mean if you have a similar door to this one then we are gonna take the measures from it like this one here it has exactly the same measures as this one if you don't have any door in your project that has the same dimensions as the one you wanna as the one you wanna open so you can just click on it and insert the same aperture with the same dimensions in a wall that is not that far so the results will become invalid yes and now it's actually the same door here we're gonna click on this one and delete it we're going to take all the measures we need from this door here the first thing we need to do right now is to make a cut from this point to this one let's go to the 3d view then let's discard all the results here then go to cut out and then make a rectangular cut out let's start from the bottom you will know why okay let's let's go click on the surface here and go to the bottom like this then go up the door is two meters high so press on tab and then type 2 and then we have a door of 2 meters we just need to go and correct the width the the width yes yeah like this now the cut out is ready we just need to add the other elements to look to make it look like a door let's go here to see how it looks now it's just a cut we need now to insert an open door here let's go to furniture and objects and then we can bring actually oh we can bring a cube like this one we'll just drag and drop it here then scale it we can scale it like this or if we want to know like the exact actually width of the frame then we can go to the tape and then measure it like from this point to this one it's 13 centimeters so we're gonna give this one exactly the same dimensions and we're gonna move it to the middle like this We need to move this up well let's go to a view a side where the view is more clear now it's it's good well there is a little part here that we yes we need to scale this one to this part and now it should be okay now it's let's now um wow what am i doing <laughs> okay let's scale this again here we need to bring this one to this point and this one to this point because this is actually gonna be our frame so <laughs> i'm sorry for that let's now copy and paste this control C control V and now we need actually 
to make the frame out of that. Let's print this one here and then this one here. We need also to go to the to this view here and then we need actually to know the width of the frame here. So let's click on this door so we can recognize it in the side views. So this one here, this is the frame width. So it's 0 0.075, which means that we need to bring the second object here, 0 0.0775 down, which is going to be a value of 2 meters minus 0 0.075, 1927, 1, oh no, 1925 actually, 1925, and then we can now select both of them, go to copy and arrange, and then we are gonna subtract this one from the, the big one, subtract. Now this is the frame. We only need to add the door here, this one, this element. The way to do it again is, could have made a copy, but it's okay, we can add another cube here. This way we can scale it, this way to fit this open door. Then we can move it here, then yes, it actually fits, not really, okay, now it's good. And we need to make it 2 meters, well not 2 meters, 1.925. And here it is, let's go here, click on our door, delete it, and here is the open door. As easy as that. Let's run the calculations. This is the calculated project. An open door like this adds like some fanciness to the work, like to be able to see inside um, a room like this. And if you wanna like move inside like this, you actually don't go through a wall or something like that. I mean. This looks more realistic, you know, to go through an open door rather than just <laughs> go through a wall or to go like through a closed door. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and see you in the next video.